Access authorized repetition. Jeff asked me to um, go in the studio and dig deep and um, to, to create something that was going to let the world know who I was and what I could do. And so, yeah, it was called AAR. And the name was too long. It it just didn't fit, it wasn't catchy enough. And so, you know, Jeff and I were having this conversation about uh, saying the Minimal Nation is rising. There's this new uh, movement called the Minimal Nation, and that's when we both said, that's it. We have to call this Minimal Nation. And so, you, you know, it's, it's funny that, you know, God, when he created the earth, and the spirit of the Lord moved over the waters, and God said, let there be. And what we spoke and in, in, in what I spoke into existence, we didn't even realize what brand new world we were creating. And in making the hi-hat do something else, but, you know, just stand there. And my whole idea with minimalism was to create rhythms inside of rhythms inside of rhythms you know, sort of hidden rhythms. I remember those uh, pictures, posters back in the 80s where if you stared into it long enough, you see a hidden picture. And so that was my idea, was to not just create diminutive art or simple art, was to draw sort of like trance music. This is real trance music. I don't know about that other stuff. You know, this is the, re this is the real deal. So, and, and so um, it, it was hypnotic. You know, and, and took you and, and drew you in. And, and my thing was to not make everybody in the club go crazy, you know, with this spiritual movement, but to have that one guy in the back of the room, you know, just lose it, you know, and just, just start to scream and almost catching the Holy Ghost. And that was my, that was my whole focus.